So let's attempt this titration problem that we came up with. Um, so using that uh, reaction equation that we had from the last problem. So um, you can see here that we have a volume of um, HCN of 15.0 mils. The molarity of HCN is 2.00 molar. And we're going to titrate that with 3.00 molar NaOH, and we're wondering what is the volume of NaOH that we're going to need to reach the equivalence point, okay? So how do we do that? Well, the first thing we have to, we're going to eventually need to use this reaction equation to do a mole-to-mole -mole ratio, okay? So first thing we need to do is figure out, well, how many moles of HCN do we have, okay? So how do we do that? Well, remember, this is moles per liter, okay? Mm -hmm. So let's just convert that. So moles of HCN per one liter of HCN. Okay, and we've got 15 mils of HCN, right? So for every one liter of HCN, 1,000 mils of HCN, except for me. I think it is, huh? <laughs> 1,000 mils of HCN, right? So we're going to say 15.0 mils. HCN, like that. That cancels out everything to give us moles of HCN. Do you see that? Mm -hmm. Does that make sense? Sure. We do, yeah. Does it? It's important that it does, and why I did it that way. Okay, so let's do it together. 2 divided by 1,000 times 15. So the number of moles is 3.00 times 10 to the negative 2 moles HCN, like that, okay? So how many moles of NaOH are going to react completely with that many moles of HCN? 3. 3.00 times 10 to the negative 2. Mm -hmm because there's a one-to-one -one ratio here. If you can't come up with that on your own, you can do this. Okay, so for every one mole of HCN you have, you got one mole of NaOH reacting with it. Okay? So, the number of moles of NaOH that we need to completely react with that many moles of HCN is going to be 3.00 times 10 to the negative 2 moles of NaOH. Like that. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. Okay, wonderful. So, but we're not interested necessarily in that number of moles of NaOH. We're interested in the, vol or in the volume, right? But we've got the concentration here, the molarity. So remember, what is molarity? That's moles per liter, right? Moles per liter. So, moles per liter, that's just a conversion factor from moles of NaOH to liters of NaOH, okay? So, we got moles of NaOH here, right? And we want volume, so we can cancel those things out using it. So we got 3.00 moles NaOH per one liter of NaOH. Like that, like that. So, divided by three, 1.00 times 10 to the negative two liters of NaOH. All right, but do we wanna keep it in liters? Let's change it back to milliliters, okay? So what do we want to do? So for every one liter, 1,000 mils. Okay, so all we have to do is 
multiply that by a thousand. And we get the answer that we would have expected, of course. Ten point oh mils of NaOH will fully titrate fifteen mils of two point oh molar um, HC. Okay? So it's just a logical stepwise process. Don't make it harder than what it is, okay? Just think, what am I looking for in this part? What am I looking for in this part? What am I looking for in this part? I have like, I don't know, 10 of these online. Check them out, okay? They're in the titration section. I'll put this one in there too. Did you get for a bowl of Oh, do you want? Okay, anybody else have any questions? Questions before I kill it? Okay, wonderful. 